NBA veteran official Bill Kennedy, his 25th season in the league, and he forgot Trey Lyle's name while ejecting him from the game after the fight with Brook Lopez. But I just want to show the lead up to the fight in case people didn't understand. So about with five minutes left in the game versus the Kings, Brook Lopez copped an elbow from DeMontis Sabonis while he was grabbing a rebound and he was bleeding. He was not happy having to get that cleaned up and that there was no foul called. Here's the play where it happened. As you see, Sabonis obviously just coming down and clipped him. Didn't even look like much, but there was still a pretty big cut. He at least got that patched up, but then we saw it. Everyone would have seen it by now. Trey Lyles goes to steal and then gives Giannis a bit of a shove, and Brook Lopez, obviously, he was a bit heated from that elbow in the cut and having to get it cleaned up and that there was no foul call. So he was letting out some anger, and he got into it with Trey Lyles, obviously backing up his star player, Giannis. But I thought I'd hop on the mic and just give you some context into why Brook Lopez might have been mad, even though... If he hadn't have had anything happen to him prior, I think some scuffle of some sort would have happened still because you just don't go shoving the team's best player like that for no reason at the end of the game as well. But that's just my thoughts, and here's Bill Kennedy forgetting Trey Lyle's name. Here A technical foul has been assessed for number 41, initial contact. A fighting foul has been assessed for both of Lopez and number 41. Both have been ejected and we'll put the ball in play on the side. So, let me just say, number 41 for the Sacramento Kings has a name. His name is Trey Lyles. 